Go back to your high school year and pretend to flip through your yearbook. You see yourself in the yearbook with the superlative biggest drama queen. <laughs> you feel this is not an accurate assessment of who you really are. You can fix that this evening. What superlative would you get and why? Would you be class clown, nicest smile, biggest flirt, most likely to, to succeed? And there are so many others. What would you choose for yourself to correct that error in your yearbook? Bobby. <laughs> I don't remember what my yearbook said. I think it was the drama queen. <laughs> Maybe. I didn't ever think I was drama queen, though. I mean, I do get animated with things, but I never was the type of person that just went bozo over things that were going on. I think probably one of the most one of the things that was said about me probably was most friendly and great smile. I loved my classmates. We always, as far as I was concerned, we always got along great. I really enjoyed high school. I didn't let schoolwork get in the way of my education. So I just had a lot of fun. My best friend, see that drop, didn't it? My best friend, <laughs> moved away at the end of eighth grade and I was devastated. She lived down the street from me and her dad had gotten transferred to a job in Olympia. So that was that was really bad, but as Vicki was telling, we have remained very close all these years. And in fact I just saw her last weekend. We had a wonderful time together. My high school days I was friendly. I think that a lot of the classmates remember me that way. And I really enjoyed and loved all my classmates. They table talking